Liverpool versus everybody. Um, hopefully we can get another clean sheet. My score prediction was two now. Yep, that's a pretty good one, and that's something that I believe that we can do. Um, but as I always feel like going into a game, as long as we can get the three points, I think that's really all that matters at the end of the day. But looking to see an inspired performance, uh, much like Watford uh, last game. Um, and, you know, it, the, the, the reality is we haven't beat Southampton, I think, in three or four tries this season. This might be the fourth. I don't. I don't remember which one. I don't remember if it was if this is the fourth, uh, or it's already been four. I think this is the fourth. But um, yeah, we haven't beat them. So uh, needless to say, we, we definitely need to get one over them. Um, we're at home, and so uh, we need to make Anfield a fortress. Um, that's always what we need to do going into these games. So hopefully we can do that. Uh, it's been a really bizarre weekend with results uh, with certain teams. It's been crazy. But that's to be expected for these last couple weeks, um, or these last few weeks, um, to end the season off. So we just got to handle our business. It's the same old thing. Um, it's been weird stuff in the news about uh, big deals being made about Daniel Sturridge um, essentially smoking hookah, or that's what we call it here in the States. Um, so I, I, to me, the journalists out there, it's, it's wild, man. I mean, to make a big deal about that. Um, anyway, um, we're looking forward to the game. Um, saw the lineup. Uh, Lucas is back in. I, I'm not really sure about that, but you know, again, I'm not a manager, so we're gonna support what Klopp thinks. Um, but yeah, we got Lalana on the bench again, Sturridge. So it's nice to see that we got some firepower coming off the bench. That's really nice. Uh, if we need it, we can go to that. Um, hopefully, we don't need it in, in, until the end, if that. Uh, and the guys that are starting can can make it happen. So um, yeah, real excited about get, getting another three points and, and, and keeping our stock in the league and. They were talking about it before the game and the build-up, and you know, it, it. I believe it's a bit of an overachievement for us to even be in the top four. Um, if we could finish off above Chelsea, it's it's a major uh, achievement, especially when people thought, uh, I'm sorry, above City, um, especially when people thought Guardiola coming in was going to be instant, you know, success and instant league winning uh, and things of that nature. So, um, just proud of the boys how, how we fought through injuries, through ups and downs, through all the adversity. Um, and yeah, looking forward to just taking another game. So, anything else you want to say? Um, yeah. Um, if you're a fan of Liverpool, you shouldn't like um say that we're gonna lose um before the game even starts. You shouldn't. Yeah, I mean, it is what it is. Uh, you know, we we have no control over the other fans. So, something that I feel like probably needs to die soon. As far as us talking about it, it is irritating, but. It is what it is. Everybody has their way of being a fan and supporter. So we have our way. We'll keep that up, and everybody else will have theirs. So we'll see you guys at halftime. Enjoy the game.